Hello, everyone. I'm so excited today to share some results from our third annual WIDS Datathon. You may recall that the first Datathon we hosted uh, focused on financial inclusion data. The second Datathon was using high resolution satellite image data. And this year, let me tell you about this year. Uh, we focused on health data, particularly uh, in a collaboration with hospital intensive care units. And uh, with 130,000 patient visits, 160 plus uh, columns, and four times the number of teams participating compared to last year. We quadrupled, yes. That is worth a round of applause. Um, we were so excited that 80% of those registered for the Datathon this year were women in an area of online predictive analytics that typically has estimates of about 20%. So good job on flipping that statistic. Um, the 951 teams of up to four people spanned 85 different countries. So that's so fantastic to see. And over the last six weeks, these teams worked together around the clock and submitted more than 12,600 submissions. This is all possible because of months of work with our Datathon uh, team, spanning a number of different organizations from the private sector and the public sector. And I have to give special thanks to Marze Gassimi from the University of Toronto for alerting us to this opportunity with this data set to uh, our colleague uh, Latanya Sweeney from the Harvard Data Privacy Lab, and to our collaborators at the MIT Global Open Source Severity of Illness Score, or GOSIS, initiative, as well as all of these uh, organizations you see here. If I could ask the folks in the room who worked on the Datathon team to stand up, we'd love to give you a round of applause and thank you so much for your leadership. We also have to give a special shout out to the dozens of WIDS ambassadors around the globe who hosted more than 20 different workshops to help team formation and to facilitate hands-on training throughout the last couple of months. Here are just a few images and there's hours of content now forevermore uh, there online for viewing. Thank you so much to the WIDS ambassadors. And now if we could get a drum roll, please, for our top three winners. In first place, we have Team Women Power from Israel. They did this with their own laptops nights and weekends. We'll be sharing more stories uh, over the next few weeks. In second place, we have Team Nullset from Ukraine. And in third place, Team Prevision.io from France. Congratulations. These teams have already started sharing uh, their problem-solving approach, and so fantastic to see. And we're super excited to announce for the first time an extension, a second phase of the Datathon with an Excellence in Research Award with the National Science Foundation Big Data Innovation Hubs. So we invite you all, whether you're working on a paper this month or not, to join our webinar this, uh, this Thursday, and we hope to see you next year. Congrats. <laughs>